Good morning. Um, yeah, oh, let me go get the light on out on the other side. Slipped in today. My cat alarm clock didn't work. It wake me up. I blame the cat. All right, so let's just get started. Um, I got a little bit of time so I can run over. Yes, my hair is all poofy. Um, all right, let's get started here. Um, November is over, it's December 1st. We can make that go away. Uh, switch over to this. Oh. get my screen to come up and log in so I'm going to White knuckle this. I've not had my morning coffee. I am going to do two hours. I am just going to go until eleven. That's all. Um, there was enough of a there's enough of a buffer before DDLPL at one o'clock that that's not going to be an issue. So there's that. Here's this. Okay. So we got that up there. Oh. Okay, alrighty, so let's get our, uh, let's bring this back up for a second, studio, stream, let me get my chat box up. All right, let's get the um, giveaway set up for this week. All right, for this week, we're going to have... Um, I'm not going to do 500 TP this week. I am going to do, because of our wonderful Black Friday sale, I am going to give a starter pack away this week. Um, I'll show you what that is in just a moment. Uh, we need 10 people. Um, this morning we have... There we go. Who do we have this morning? We have... No mod restriction. So we have Titan 2014-19. We got Titan. We've got Xander. We got Virtual. Who else do we have this morning? 
Yes, the hireling comes in very handy. Do 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 do. Clear that all out. Ah, oh, there we go. We got El Pair. We got Peter823. Anybody else in there this morning? <laughs> That's awesome. If you're out there, let me know. All right, let's shrink this down here. All right, so we got a poll going on the wiki this week, um, or this month. I did some more digging and some more research. Um, and it turns out that December 20, 2005 wasn't exactly... The first thing that I could find, the first thing I could find was January 4th, 2016. Um, let's scroll back here, see if I can find the edit for that. Uh, November 23rd. Looks like it's been a busy week. Looks like it's been a week, busy week, and we've had more than a thousand changes. Interesting. Let's collapse that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on the 500 here. And I'm going to go up to the URL bar because we've had more than a thousand. I'm going to change that to 2,500 on the limit. That way I can see more edits in the last seven days. And that's all of them. Okay. Uh, deletion log. I deleted Titan. Okay, so that's that. I remember doing that. Let's see here. Template home projects. Home. Okay, so I did some deleting on the wiki. I took a huge risk. Um, I deleted the home page, which has been known to lock up things like Wikipedia before and cause major issues. Um, I did it anyway, because I needed to do what is known as a history merge. Um, I found that the first revision, um, old ID one, the um, first revision on the wiki whatsoever, um, was in this page called old home. Somebody had moved it there and started a new home page and that history of the wiki was lost. So I deleted the home page. I moved that old home back to the home page. I deleted that. I restored only the restored only the first version and then I restored all of the old home page. Um, what what that did is it um, restored the first version of the home page, which if we go all the way down, is uh, January 4th, 2006 at 4.44 Central Time. Um, if we take a look at that, the very first version, very first page on the wiki, um, just the wiki software successfully installed by MediaWiki Default. It's the default page, and you can see that the old ID up here is old ID number one. That means it is the first edit ever on the wiki. So this is the first ever edit on the wiki um, and it was done automatically by the software when it was installed um, so uh, I don't have coffee and the kitty is yelling at me um, so yeah 444 p.m. Central Standard Time on January 4th 2006 so I got to dig in in my calendar and I started looking here and and It turns out that January 4th, 2016 is going to be on a Monday. Um, 
based on that, I decided to do the drawing for the 10th anniversary, the giveaway show on um, January 5th. means I have a month to research and dig out and find out who's winning what. Um, I've got a rough outline right now for prizes. They will be going up on the wiki in the next week or so. Um, so that's all of that. Uh, let's see here. What else happened this week? Did some more founder stuff. Um, creating a template for founder date. Did some game revision dates fixes. Some cleanup there. Um... I um, made 5,000 Renown last night on Shoemaker, um, picked up my plus 5 Contome, um, Epic Tiard, and then plus 20 into a Monk, because my VIP actually expires like right now. Um, I'm going to let it lapse for a month or so, use up some of my Turbine points. Um, Alright, and then we're up to today. Oh, I plus 20 into a monk because I'm going to lose that, and then I TR'd, heroic TR'd, back into a 1 arty 19 cleric build, which is like my utilitarian build. Works really, really nice. I, I really love it. Um, let's see here. Oh, we got... A little red exclamation mark here. That means this is a, an edit by Solar Power that hasn't been patrolled yet. Is it true what I hear about a certain cleric piking? Um, fact: shoe pikes. Myth: He cries and gets upset when people are, are upset by that. Um, is that the one you're talking about? Because that very well may be true. Although it's not likely. Um, so we have Solar Power here, has 27 edits. We're going to give them a template on their page. I don't need to watch that. On the talk page, we will go with... Do they have a welcome message yet? They should. They do. Good. I need to update that welcome message, actually. Um, so we can click on see what they changed, because it's got a red exclamation mark there, so we want to patrol it for them. Looks like they changed it to copper ingot. They just swapped them. Um, Which is correct because copper does fall from blue and silver does drop from white. So that's good. We can mark that as patrolled. And then when we visit recent changes, that won't be there anymore. I've been known to bike a time or two. Um, so on, on the home page of the wiki, we have this poll going on. And that's going to be for the wiki's grand prize for our anniversary um, thing. Um, it's good. It's an open poll. It's uh, who do you think has been the most influential DDO Wiki contributor? You can pick any editor you want. Uh, feel free to share a short story about why you pick the person that you do. Um, any editor is edit for the is eligible. Um, pick any editor you want. So anyone is eligible. Um, everyone gets only. One vote, which means that you can only vote once. Um, and I'll assume the newest post on the thread will be your vote, if it includes a vote. Um, you can reply to other people's stuff and not actually add a second vote, and it'll just be whatever you said, I vote for this person. Um, the main purpose of this... Um, is... 
this line right here. Whomever gets the most votes will get a short blurb about them on the Wiki's homepage to be added during the January 5th, 2016 DDO Wiki Talk with D13 uh, special 10th anniversary show. Um, I can do that. Um, it's basically, it's a combination. The short blurb, blurb is going to be the combination of everybody's vote that gave a story. If you give a story, then part of that story will be incorporated into the short story for a month or two or a year or whatever on the homepage about 10th anniversary. This was voted the most, you know, influential editor. Um, the person with the most votes that is still active in the game will win a very special prize in the show. It is currently not 100% for sure what that prize is going to be yet. Um, I still need to talk to Coder Van to try to iron that out and get something set that we know would be okay. Um, the polling will close at 10 a.m. Eastern on December 26, 2015, so that I will have like a week to be able to look through and read everybody's and set up something. Um, so it looks like we've got so far um, we have a Niblung, um, we have an All, we have an All, which doesn't really do much, um, the All votes, thank you for your comments on the spread, but it doesn't really help the, the purpose of the, um, thing anything. We have a Shoe because of my picture. Um, we have an Mjol who is retired. He's not an active user. Um, he was a map guy. I really wish that he would come back or we'd get another map guy. We got a, a shoe. Um, we've got another all. Um, I'm guessing that's the home page, which is always, which is usually last edited by me, based on work by, um, Zevo, JJMZ, good old Jan, Crew121, Turlon, Shade, who rage quit because he couldn't get things his way, um, Simon Richards is Ultra Monk apparently, Agenshar, Guild Remember is retired. Arch is retired. Elliot is retired, but is still on the free node version of our IRC channel. Um, I don't even know who that person is. Teocan is retired. Uh, Piro is retired. Pepsi Freak is retired. Uh, Deed is retired. We have Yoko. Yogg has been inactive for a couple years, so I'm guessing he's retired, although he hasn't said anything. Um, we have Blage, we have Neo, we have Burrow, who has retired a long time ago. Um, Silverside and Silverside O, old, are both retired, and then the bot and a bunch of IPs, whoever they may be. Um, and then we have Hakushi, who has an all, so... Get your votes in there. Vote for Shoe. I want the prize. Um, anyway, let's see here. Um, Titan wants me to check his contributions. That's an interesting place to put that comment, Titan. Um, getting me on um, Slack or on Facebook or something is usually more productive than this. And it just happened that I, you know, rolled over and went back to sleep when I was, my alarm woke me up at 6:30 instead of getting up at 7 like I usually do. So, not a biggie. Uh, contributions 78. So Titan has 78 contributions. 
we go to Titan's page, we can go edit. We can go user edit award 78. In a minute, I'll feed you. No, not now. In a minute, you can wait. So Titan has 78 edits and counting. Um, when he hits the 100 edit tier, he will probably get a promotion to super user, and he will get to see those little red exclamation marks to be able to patrol things. Uh, let's see here, recent changes. You like how I put my characters on my page. Uh, I really need to update that. Uh, that would be this page right here. Tells you all about how the characters are. I actually need to update the template that is used for this. It doesn't take into account anything epic. Um, it doesn't take into account Epic Depths, Destinies, or um, Epic Levels. Um, yes, I like human females, apparently, and drow. Um, but it tells you the server with a link to the server page. It gives you a link to... Um, my slash character slash character name of server. Um, can you pass me the template? Um, all you need to do, Titan, right, is edit my characters page, which isn't protected, and you can roll down. You can see that it's called character sheet character. So you start with your character sheet head. And you put that inside of a table like this. So you basically copy that line. And then you do character sheet character, which is this template right here. You can actually just go to this template and it shows you how to do it. Copy the template, right? And then you put it on your page, you fill in the information. For you, you want Thalanus. You delete everything except Thalanus. Um, you put in the name of the character. You put in the race of the character. Human, elf, dwarf, halfling, drow, half or half elf, warp orge. You specify if it's male or female. You put in your classes. Um, it looks like... I need to add Artificer, nope, Art's down here. Um, looks like I still need to add Warlock. They go in order of release, so Warlock will just end up at the bottom down there. Um, you can put in your guild URL if you have one, um, your guild name, your rank, member, officer, successor. Uh, I don't remember what L was supposed to be. Uh, left, maybe. Left the guild or something. Um, and then a bio is just a description about what you want. Um, so let's see here. Back to the homepage real quick. So we got update 28 here. Um. Ah, uh, leader. Yes, probably. You are probably correct. Um, site map is pages about the game. About DDO Wiki is pages about the wiki. Um, so what I'm going to do is... 
I'm probably going to expand this by adding another row and put in a three row wide um, short story based on the short stories from the forums about whoever wins the most influential wiki editor. Um, it'll stay up on the homepage for a little while, and then it will actually move to the, um, show you the page for that, the 10th anniversary celebration page, which I need to work on. It is currently, where is it? Ooh, um, don't do that shoe. DDO Wiki 10th anniversary. It's currently right there. Um, there'll be a table, a couple tables up here. The first table will be the prize spreadsheet that I have. Once I have it figured out a little bit better, um, there'll be a description about what the anniversary is. There'll be some stuff about the show that's going to happen. And um, all right, I'm going to go feed the cat because she's being really annoying. Eating the couch because she's so hungry. You eating the couch because you're so hungry? All right, get on the couch and I'll feed you. Good girl. She thinks she's a dog. So I give her commands like a dog and she listens. Okay, go eat. Why are you yelling at me? I fed you. Eat it. Get you some fresh water. While I'm over here, make a pot of coffee for my break. Or as quickly as I can. Well, I know they can still hear me, and they're probably like, shoo, we could still hear you talking to yourself. It's a little weird. It is weird. Um, I do it all the time. So do you, so don't deny it. Uh, coffee. Filter. Get the coffee out of the freezer. Yes, I freeze my coffee. Little tip for you. Frozen coffee tastes better. Freeze your coffee grinds. Brew them right from a frozen state. Tastes much better. And that's the, the secret to good coffee. Frozen coffee grinds. That's preposterous. It is indeed. Do I think... Okay, so we get a new person. We need to add. We have... Um... Add you to the list there. Welcome. Welcome to the show. Um, let's see, how many more people do we need? Looks like we need four more people in order to give away a starter pack this week. I um, purchased some starter packs from the DDO store during our um, wonderful Black Friday sale for $1.50 a piece. Um, and that's today's prize. Um, So, let's see here. That's where our 10th anniversary stuff's going to be. Pages sourced by DDO forums because I use the forums template. That should actually be getting quite full. 456 pages have stuff linking to the forums. That's pretty intense. Yeah, I thought about it, but I slept in. So, I'm guessing that a lot of people that were here at 8 o'clock till probably like quarter past gave up and I am not going to penalize everybody else because I slept overslept 
But next week, we'll go up to 25. I don't know. The best tasting coffee I ever have is when you freeze the coffee grounds and you brew it straight from frozen. That's how she does it. <sighs> Alright, so what are we going to edit this week? I'm still only half awake, so... Give me some suggestions. Titan, you're usually pretty good for that. Developer words. Dirty Dexter. Blinding Speed. Alright, I remember you saying something about that. Let's add Dirty Dexter here. Blinding Speed. Well, let's do a search. Blinding speed, right there. Looks like there's already a page. So, this is the one that Titan tried to make. Yep, alright, so let's take do edit and see this. Prizes indeed. This week we're giving away a starter pack. Oh, I was going to show what a starter pack was. Um... Doesn't look like there's a specific page on the starter pack itself. But, let's see here. Companion. DDO Market. So you get a, a fiendish scorpion. Found a character on whatever character uses it first. You get a... Ellery Thistle Down, level three permanent cleric, uh, permanent it's a stub right now. You get five experience elixir. Um, I believe they are superiors. Nope, they are excellence. So you get these ones right here. You get five of these. Ah, studio starter pack. Sales, hireling. Just an empty page saying it's a work in progress. I actually have some stuff that I started working on for that. Um, got those. And then we have... Yeah, nothing there. Okay. So I guess the best way to look at it is just to go to the DDO market and take a look at it. Looks like they're still technically on sale. Um, you get catacomb, you get the catacombs adventure pack. You get a fiendish scorpion pet. You get a permanent level three cleric hireling. You get five excellent elixirs, and you get 250 turbine points. So it's a good week. You can either use it yourself, or 
You can give it away to a family member that you want to try to convince to play the game to give them a little something extra to get started with. Um, so I am actually going to start a page for starter pack. But first, we're going to take a look at Titan's winding speed. All right, so we got... All right, so it looks like what we need to do is we need to get rid of these spaces. Putting a leading space in front of anything, any line, actually formats it in this box, which is like a... It, it, it delimits it as code. Um, if you want to bump it in, you just put it against the wall there. Um, you wanted to link enhancement bonus. Actually, you only need to link that once. And you tried to link it as a template, but it's not. It is using square brackets. You could also link movement speed, attack speed, attack roll, Dodge bonus, reflex saving throw, preview. Let's see which ones of those work. Movement speed didn't work. Oh. And reflex saving throws didn't work, but I believe we can move this over to just reflex. It will work. Search. I'm guessing it's a capitalization issue on that. Attack roll. Attack speed. So there's attack speed. There's run speed. Attack roll. Reflex save. Okay. <clears throat> so reflex can stay just the way it is except what I'm gonna do is, is I'm going to drag this back over here I'm going to put in reflex save I'm gonna make pipe links for this run speed uh, alright so I'm gonna open this up and I am going to make this a redirect to that. It's just a case issue. There's already a redirect from the lowercase version. Make that go away. Attack speed. So if I open up attack speed here, I can make that a redirect to attack speed. Movement speed goes to run speed now. We have that, which is here. Attack roll, is, it's another lowercase issue again. Uh, shrink that. Creating attack roll with a capital R. We can link hasted like that. Paste that in there. All redirect, all copy, paste, save. Okay, so now if we do a show preview, those should all turn blue. That looks good to me. We don't need this comment up here. Um, sounds like my coffee's done brewing. That's awesome. I'll go get that in a minute.
There's that. Titan may win. <laughs> oh. Hmm. Did my chat freeze up? I believe it did. Did I drop? My connection looks good. Okay, there we go. Looks like it's catching up. All right. So I also have the chat on my phone so that if it freezes up, I can still see what's going on. Um, really useful using IRC to, um, to chat. Um. <clears throat> all right, so we got this all set. That's Titan's blinding page feed, blinding speed page. Um, is this page used anywhere? Epic feats. So what you may want to do is, since it's only an epic feats and attack speed, you might want to go through each one of these, like enchantment bonus, attack speed, attack road, rolls, dodge bonus, reflex, saving throws. You might want to go to each one of those pages. And... Um, Make sure that you reference that this is a source for those. Um, yeah, it looks like my chat box is locked up over here in the um, in the stream, but it's still working. Okay, let me see if I can fix that. Nope, it's not just your system, and welcome. Let's reconnect. It says it's connecting. While that's connecting, let's add J A E O O R H as an attendee. Now we only need two more to be able to roll for that starter pack. There we go. And that fixes that. All right, so um, looks like only let's go check out our epic feats. Epic feats, blinding speed. There you go. You're permanently hasted. Level twenty-seven. 
Um, do we have a feats by level page? Feats. Free active feats. We don't. Interesting. Or at least I don't see it yet. We don't. That would be an awesome table page to put together. Um, feats by minimum level. Or feats by class. That would be awesome. Um, we've got them broken up by class and dragon mark and meta magic and racial and apex and destiny and legendary and all that stuff which is a new thing coming. Legendary feats based on the Mania preview. Um, and that's all in there. Based on, mostly based on the forums. Um, so yeah. Go ahead and add some links to that Titan. 15,000 BPS. I'd say you're lagging out there, Titan. Maybe you're causing my Twitch, Twitch lag. Um, <laughs> All right, so starter pack. Let's start an article about this. Let's go to the DDO market. Copy this chunk of code. Um, lowercase b means bits per second. So creating starter pack. Let's paste all that text in there. <coughs> and we're going to put in one of those and one of those. And one of those and two of those and one of those. Preview. That didn't work quite the way I wanted it to. I wanted those to be double indented. <laughs> Catacombs, Adventure Pack, Friar Renault, Marguerite. Fiendish Scorpion Pet. Let's do it that way instead. C 
see how that works. That looks better, except that I want those to be small. Hmm. I don't have small tags in there. Okay. So I'll go to the end and I'll go small. Bound a character. Bound a character. This one's bound to account. When is Lamania coming up? And we have Sick Boy here. So Sick Boy 138. I have no idea. Um, they haven't even announced that it's going to be coming up to the player's council yet, so I'm guessing it will be soon, TM. Ellery Thistledown. Link that. Sands of Mercutum. Four tricks. Level three hireling. Uh, cure wounds. Remove paralysis. Um, experience. Turbine point. Actually, that should be linked up there, not down here. details later. Cordova mentioned on Friday at 4 last week that it would be this week, maybe during the weekly Wednesday stream. Um, no, actually it's um, a trademark of all products. <laughs> <clears throat> so Cure Wounds, we should probably link that. Since the, the sale is still going on, I'll mention that um, you can pick up Shadowfill Collectors for 750 right now. Um, standard for 450, Underdark Standard for 525, Menace of the Underdark Base Edition for three dollars. 85 percent off right now. Um, starter pack. You can also get Half Orc and Druid. Or three dollars each. So that's the DDO market. That's where you can use actual cash to buy stuff in game. I'm actually going to put some more money on my card and pick up a few more of these later today, um, if they're still available on sale. Um, creating cure wounds. I don't want to create cure wounds. I want to search for it and edit the page. And Ellie gives probably cure light wounds. Uh, 
cure light wounds. I'm guessing that's what Ellie does. Um... And there's a quick way to find out. Um, this little Twitch chat box will be for a different stream, so. Oh, while that loads up, let me do this. All right. What happened to mods having all the info for DDO in chat? At Seamorigu. Hmm. I don't know, Titan. You tell me. You're a mod. Um, so I'm guessing it's Cure Light Wounds. So, we can pipe link. Uh, Let's um, visit Thalanus real quick. Uh, she'll preview while that loads. Hellfire crossbow. Um, I don't know, are you lucky? We'll find out when we do the roll at the end of the stream. And it's 10 o'clock, wow, already? That was a quick two hours. <laughs> no, it's, um, it is break time though to get coffee and go to the bathroom and all that good stuff. Um, but before we do that, let's head into the game real quick. Oh, I guess I can just do it this way without switching to in-game. Which doesn't... Ah, there it is. All right, and that doesn't make much difference, so we'll just go to DD Wiki Talk. Because I almost never play on this one anyway. All right, so we still get this error, blah, 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 received when trying to retrieve information about any support tickets associated with the account. I had thought they fixed that, and then it broke. And then I had thought they fixed it again, and apparently it's still, like, just not, not fixed right. So we now have the Druid Pack, the Starter Pack, and the Shadowfell Conspiracy Collector's Edition claim ticket. So let's hit inventory, and here's our our cleric. I cannot summon her in a public place. What's wrong with her? Oh, let's run over to the the wilderness here. Because I am doing research, Titan, and you can actually not hear my in-game. Let's turn that on. All right, so let's summon Ellery. Let's see, what does she get? She gets Cure Moderate Wounds. Interesting. She also gets Command and Cleric Divine Vitality 1 um, and Remove Paralysis. So I actually want to go like this. Um, you stand right there. Don't move. Let's get a screenshot of her. Um, let's see if I can use this to capture. Uh, let's just try to make it a little blocky and square like this. I like that, that looks good. Game sounds are a bit loud, are they? I don't hear any game sounds at the moment, so. Oh, <laughs> you heard my game sounds coming from my speakers in through my microphone, I see. So I really don't even need to have that. So we're gonna take that for the snipping tool. Uh, we're gonna save it as documents, Dungeons and Dragons Online. We're gonna make it 
Ellery Thistle down dot PNG. Specify the date taken. Save. Um, We're just going to take a regular screenshot of that. That gets the fact that she's a cleric three female halfling. And I, apparently I have augments summons, but okay. Um, you can see her with Sonic there. I can try to resummon her with a different color. <laughs> uh, get a bigger monitor. <laughs> How do you adjust the user interface size of the bars and stuff? You don't. <laughs> um, it, it's actually something that I've talked to the developers about, and at this time, it is not feasible to... Ooh, I want a mirror of glimmering. That's pretty cool. Um... I don't get mirrors of glimmer, glimmering very awesome. Um, oh yeah, I talked to the developers and that is not currently something, it would require an, an entire UI interface overhaul and it's not something they're willing to do at this time. So, or it's not something they have the resources to do at this time, I should say. That's probably more appropriate because it's such a large thing See, by putting it down in chat, I could actually move it around to where I want it and then take a screenshot. And then I can double click on it and add it to my stable. And then I could take a screenshot of that. I can tell you to go away, customize UI. We should have our customized orders out here. We should get a screenshot of that. Um, make the summon go away. I really don't like having summons pets out. All right. So I've got a lesser tome of learning I should use. Um, drag that up there. That's also in this pack, so we're going to take a screenshot of that. Titan Lock has logged off. Titan Lock has logged on. Interesting. I don't know who this Titan guy is, but he keeps logging in and out. Showing up in my chat down there. Come on. Drag this up over here. Take a screenshot of that. What else is in the starter pack? Catacombs, Fiendish Scorpion Pet, Cleric Hireling, Elixirs. Oh, Turbine Points. So, uh, you won't actually get to see that. Because if you're patient, oh, if you're impatient, you can actually. Click and drag, and it will show you loading up in the corner there. <clears throat> so I don't know why they don't have loading just like show up there, um, but you actually have to force it to show up. Stream is offline again. So yeah. You'll see it. All right, coffee. And good morning, Edward. 
Um, so I think we're done out here with this. So we can just quit. We're done with that. I got to add Edward to our list here. And Edward is going to be number 10. So now we have enough people to roll for our starter pack, which is what I was just showing you and what we have here. Uh, excellent experience elixirs should be linked. All right. Add a little comment here. Let's see if we can get a few more people in here. Select all, copy, send. All right, let's see here. So <clears throat> now we can head over to Ellery. Remove paralysis is, doesn't have that for some reason. Let's do a search. It's got a capital P, okay. So we'll just edit it to fix it with a capital P. And actually, we found out that it's not light, it's moderate. And this is remove paralysis. Light wounds, we're done with that. Remove paralysis, we're done with that. Um, edit. Oh, good morning, Hazelnut. Who else do we have this morning tuning in late? Okay, so we got work in progress. Um, hire link? Is that a template? It is, but it doesn't do what I want it to do. It's not the template I want. It's for a table. It's for this hireling table style thing. Well, let's see, do we have a category hirelings?
Do we have a category for hirelings? We do. All right, so we got this. I'm gonna open that. Why is ah uh, Iason? Okay, interesting. Take a look at Iason. and how that one's done. List of hirelings. Edit. Hirelings, only we're going to put a space in there. Category sorting, that should be at the top of that category page, not embedded into it. Um, let's take a look at how these are done as well. Okay, so I've got that one, got that one. So that seems to be I hate it when that comes up. All I can do is hit back and save page again. Attack quality. So. That one's a little bit different. Okay, owl bear. That one's a little bit different, but those are special cases. Uh, another source of 10 epic DR. Okay. Unbreakable. I believe that is correct. All right, so hireling, so that one should be at the top now. If I do a refresh here, make that go away. Hireling, list of hirelings, okay, good. I assume, okay, good. So let's close this, close this. Let's edit this page and see how I did it. Oh, okay. So what I do is just copy ISN, paste it here. So replace ISN, ISN, it's going to be a PNG, ISN, uh, halfling, gender, female, level, three, cleric, hireling, I don't have the description as far as that goes. So just dot, 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 attack to be determined. CLR three, I can mention that she's a level three, a permanent level three. And I can't spell, thank you spell checker. Background gray, um, background color, because if you have a sortable table, it doesn't like it if it's not specified that way. And I don't really like gray, but I'm going to get rid of that later. Um, cleric, female, halfling, name. Um, Cure, moderate wounds, remove remove paralysis. Um, if we do them in order, the first one was cleric, divine, in Intervention one. Uh, my memory is horrible. Yes, you have off topic chapsite, and we know that. We are aware of that. I don't remember what the second one was. 
luckily, we can go to our screenshots here. Uh, scroll down. Oh, command. Okay. Back to this. Wrong one, I want this one. So this one's command. All right. Um, cost platinum, not available. Cost astral shards, not available. Cost DDO store, not available. Available, DDO. Market and dot dot dot. Yeah, I do that too. That's actually how I get through Inferno, using my Scorched. Cleric Divine Intervention 1 doesn't exist. This image doesn't exist. That should not be an edit. That should be a page. Oops. It is case sensitive. Page. File. Okay. Let's search for other articles for Cleric Divine Intervention 1. Upload it. <coughs> I'm a little bit laggy here, apparently. Halflin? What's a halflin? Let's fix that. All right. Cleric. <sighs> DDO market can probably be linked. Choose file. Um, if I type in asterisk.png here, it will refine it here. Um, LRE thistle down, open. I think that's you, Titan. Upload file. Cleric divine intervention. So if I get rid of the one. That's not correct. Are there any other places that capstone? Um, it should be in, really? It should be in, um, Cleric Radiant Servant. Here one. No, it's in War Priest. Okay.
So it's not War Priest. The only one left is Divine Disciple. Ah, that's where it is. Ignore warning and save anyway. Okay, that's that. So it's a, it's a tier one. Divine vitality. So it should be cleric divine vitality one. Which is going to be a link back to Divine Disciple Tier 1. And save the page. <clears throat> Reload this page, and that should no longer be a stub. Excellent. The image is not showing up properly for some reason. Scroll down. That's because there's no file in front of it. Show preview. Now that'll be fine. Okay, Fiendish Scorpion Pet. Recent changes. All right, so there's Ellery Thistledown. I might make her bigger. Let's make her bigger. What happens if I just get rid of the 200 PX? Mixer a little bit bigger, good. List of hirelings. Ten thirty. Wow, only half an hour to go. Let's see here. Hireling vendors. List of hirelings. Oh, let's sort them by level. Head down to level three. Let's see if Ellery is in there. She is. Okay, and she has a compendium page. Interesting. <clears throat> Where does that take us? 404 page not found. Okay, that's what I had. That's what I had thought. Um, although, if we cut this and we go to uh, what was the name of that page? The Wayback Machine. We go to the Wayback Machine, and we put in this. Let's see if we can pull up a, a snapshot of it at some point. Apparently not. Let's see what there is archived from the compendium.
So we got the, the Wayback Machine looking for old compendium pages. Looks like there was 371. Somebody went through and picked up 371 of the compendium pages before they blew it up. So we got alignment change, we got Kalmar Vest, Kalmar's Vest, classes, with some categories in there. Disrawl, named, I'm not sure what that is. Uh, favor, feet, augment summoning. Let's see what they have for hirelings. They're for hireling, they picked up filtering out the categories. We got Atheus the door. We got four A's and Kendra Esselstyn. All right, so we can actually go through and edit this list of hirelings. And we can dump control Find, uh, control C, uh, that's right. I'm in Chrome, and Chrome is horrible at it. So we've got this, we can actually delete. We can delete that. Only ones I need to be careful of are the A's. Arnold Swartz. Uh, nope, we don't have Arnold Swartz in our list of A's. So we can get rid of that one. Helga. Get rid of that one. Scroll down. We don't have any of these. So we can Get rid of that, 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 get rid of that. What was the oddball? Kendra. Get rid of that. So there's Kendra. We're going to leave her. Um, Mulgan. Arius. Uh, nope, no Arius. Don't have this one. What we're going to do is we're going to take Kendra here. I'm going to open that in a new tab. Oh. The web archive for that might be a 404 not found. Let's keep moving on. We know we don't have flower. We know we don't have any of these. Got an A there. Arkin, do we have Arkin? Nope, no Arkin. Get rid of that. So it looks like the only capture for this is a 404. So 
we don't have Kendra. I can get rid of Kendra. It makes me wonder, do we have any of the other ones? Or are they all 404s? They're all 404s, so we don't have any of them. Sometimes you can get lucky. So what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to copy the contents of this page. I'm going to crop it right out. I'm going to open up Notepad with a new tab and paste. And then I'm going to go and I'm going to take and I'm going to uh, blow this up so you can read it. And I'm going to... Oh, I forgot I was unplugged. And my headset was dead when I started. Let's plug this back in. All right, we only got 20 minutes left. I'm just going to rough it out for my coffee. Um, so we got this right here. We got this. And we are going to do a control H. And we are going to make this right here be dot star question mark. Because um, we're going to use regex. We're going to delete all this. Regular expression, we need to go in here and we need to escape our bracket here. We need to escape our slash and our slash and our dot. Oop. And we need to escape that dot. And we need to escape the slash and the slash and the square bracket and the dash, I believe. All right, so replace. So now we can replace all, and all 66 of them are taken care of. Chop all that back out, close that, paste it back in here. Pendium is gone. None of these are actually archived on the Wayback Machine getting rid of dead links. Um, usually we keep dead links unless um, we've done extensive research um, digging to try and see if we can't um, find the information on the Wayback Machine or another archiving page. Um, I know there's a couple other ones. I don't remember what they are off the top of my head, but Let's take a look at Chalice's page. That's just the work in progress for that, okay. Um, I was in the progress of changing that template over, I guess. All right, let's take a look at recent changes here. Um, looks like Dewey P, Dewey, Dewey Pie has been editing. Uh, Glenn uploaded a picture. Scara. Um, Dupy added some search values there to Relic. Added some stuff there. Interesting. 39 works on hard. 43 on Elite. Thirty works on elite with suboptimal results. Fight the guards only. I guess that needs some updating there. Um, back to the home page. Scara Devotee of Earth. Is this used anywhere? It is used on the Sakara page, okay. Looks good to me. 
Must be a Temple of Elemental Evil thing, part one, yes. Looks really narrow and scrunchy, though. I'm going to have to update that screenshot with something less scrunchy at some point. Um, don't forget to vote in the poll. <sighs> this is episode 11. Uh, let's see here. Nothing added to the poll here. Shame on you. Subscribe threads. Okay, so I don't have that in there. Let's, let's go to thread tools. I want to subscribe to this thread. Notification type through my control panel only. Yes, add subscriptions. Um, quick links, subscribe threads, this should show up there now. <sighs> Waiting for it to load. DDO Wiki Talk, T13. Episode 10 last week is now available. And when I drop, I actually upload from a local copy of the stream, so it won't um, it won't have any breaks in it as far as if I dropped or something. Um, episode 10 is right there. We had a lot of people last week because I got up early and got on a couple servers and advertised. I will do that again next week. I just overslept this week. Titan didn't wake me up like he was supposed to. It's all Titan's fault. Um, doing Christmas tree at work. Cool. Well, I'm about to do the drawing in about five minutes. Um, by the end of the day, I will have this updated with episode 11. Um, by the end of the day, the winner for the prize will also have received their um, their code in, as, via PM on Twitch. Looks like Lamania is not currently up. Um, anything interesting on Mibit? In the DDO channel? Is Titan your cat, dog, hamster? I don't know, Titan. <laughs> he even went to my Facebook. Yeah, he sent me a private message on Facebook. He didn't. He didn't call me on the phone though. Come on, Titan. I expected my phone to ring, and you say, you know, hey, Titan, get, you know, hey, Shu, get up. This is Titan. You need to get up and stream. Um, Throw that in there. Well, my phone actually already does that. I guess I was just like sound asleep. Um, so I mentioned it on IRC. Let's see here. Originally posted by Cordovan. <laughs> Our release notes for Patch 1 Hotfix 2 is just a quote from the forums interesting mostly random mg zeta lock no there's no rules on twitch that way all right so what do we got hmm 
Mostly random games. Wow, that got scrolled right, chopped right off. All right, mostly random games. Not when I'm sleeping, Penguin. Zeta lock. Um, no, I wouldn't say it's crashing. And we have Penguin, who hadn't ch talked in chat yet. I really should add a counter. It tells you how many people we have after we hit the, the required 10. Uh, everybody here? Let's see here. Roll a one, huh? <laughs> uh, we're gonna give everybody four more minutes. I'll, I'll draw it at 10.55. Let's hit the forums real quick here. When was Hotfix 2? It's been a while, hasn't it? Since they've done any Hotfix? We don't know yet, Hazelnut. We'll know shortly. Um, yeah, October 30th, it's been an entire month with no update. Oh, Amaref, add Amaref. Back with milk and cookies. Oh, Peter's trying to bribe me. He knows I have a sweet tooth for pastries. All right, let's see here. So the last update was <laughs> uh, November 2nd. No, you can't. If you already have a, a starter pack and you win, then I'll come up with something else for you. Um, we'll work that out. Um, it might be something as simple as, you know, in-game loot, something from the community prize list or something. Uh, I'm sure I could get Quarter Van to hook you up with that. Yeah, see, you can't bribe me with money, Titan. Pastries, on the other hand, pastries might work. All right, so... Quiet group there. But that would work too. You can do that too. All right, so I don't see anything else to edit right now. My brain is like locked up because I haven't had any coffee or anything. So um, empty coffee cup, need to fill that up. So let's do our drawing, get it done and over with. Uh, we can do some cropping of that next week, maybe. Shrink that down. All right, so. TP code giveaway. Let's blow that up. I know, right, Xander? Quick and easy to make pastry. Dutch baby pancake, huh? Am I allowed to give the... Yes, you are. Absolutely. You can give the pack to whoever you like. All right, so let's roll for winner. Ready? Who's feeling lucky? And Hazelnut. Hazelnut is our winner. You win. 
Sorry, Titan, I didn't roll a one. I rolled an 11. So I rolled a double one. Alrighty, so let's shrink that down so I don't forget. And let's go here and bring up my big ugly mug. And switch to that. And thank you everybody for tuning in this week. Um, started a little bit late. Ran pretty much an extra hour um, because of that. Um, wearing my... DDO monk shirt today because I got my monk life done on shoemaker yesterday last night um, It was a cheat life um, Yeah, right I plus 20 into monk and about five minutes later. I was a level one artificer again. So yeah I, 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 Sorry, I don't like playing monk and with the lack of love that monks have gotten I have no interest in playing monk anytime in the near future um, I do know that sometime between update 31 and update 33 so like the first half of next year they're planning on doing the monk pass and when they do the monk pass they plan on gutting out and redoing hand wraps so that they work more like weapons um that is a monk shirt i do i, I well i'll get you your code hazel one way or another Maybe I'll just PM you on IRC and, as it's the easiest way to do it. Um, I'll also send the, the message on Twitch, and I can send it on the forums too if that's easier for you. Um, so anyway, I will see you next week on the same shoe channel at the normal shoe time of 8 a.m. Eastern. Um, everybody have a great week.